doing it. We're going fishing in the boat. She's not the prettiest boat, but she floats. And we're good to go. made it to Bribey but the water's not looking the best on this side it was a lot calmer on the other side but I think I'm still going to try here anyway there is also public toilets here my suggestion would be probably to hover on them do not sit they are gross but it's behind a door that counts Fishing on! I'm excited now. First things first. Squid! Let's catch some scary alien creatures. Maybe. If this boat keeps rocking like this, I won't be fishing for very long. I'll probably have my head in a bucket. I feel like I've got to leave this out here for a little while. I get impatient with lure rods. I need bait. I need some exciting stuff to happen. We'll be right back. Come on, some squid. I just thread it on a few times until it fills up the hook. And then I pull that up the line. Squid. Hopefully I can catch something cool. A little shovel nose. You can go back in the water now. Thanks, mate. 
Have a good day. Bye, buddy. Let's see what else we can get. That was fun. Let's go again. Another piece of squeeze. On my new rod. My new lucky rod. Hopefully I don't catch something too big on this one and snap this one as well. Get rid of all the jelly stuff that comes out of the sweet. We don't need that stuff. Hopefully we can catch something else now. That was exciting. We'll try a bit of what have we got here. Hand, handy pack filters. Because I was too lazy to cast net this morning. It was cold at 6 o'clock when I got out here. It is what it is, so babe it is. I won't bore you all. I'll bring you back when something cool happens. Just stay tuned. Be back soon. It's a bit more serious. Might have me a solid brim here. Could be a solid catfish too. Or a solid stingray, but it's not cool. But just in case. I'll probably lose this fish dicking around trying to get to it. But anyway, it's probably gonna be something gross anyway. Probably be a cool flathead or something. Got a bull shark. Mm. Oh, gonna... oh, you asked. I'm gonna have to get my hooks out of that. That wet my phone. I don't like seeing stuff in my boat.
duties. Yeah, and then I'm not even bringing that thing in my buggy. Squeal like a pig. I got bitten by a shark. I don't like doing this, it's scary. some waves that are coming for me. Uh oh. Hold on. not going to be any wind today. The water's going to be perfect. Well, it was when I first got over here, and now it's picked up again. Hmm. That's all right. I'm really not that far from land. I could swim there, but I don't know if I can swim or not. I'll float there. We got this. That's only if I get kicked out of the boat. I just caught a bull shark. I'm not getting in there. No way.
the ray. You might keep this one. They're actually really, really good eating. Where are you again? a really fat fish. Let's see how big he goes. You know, cut it all up. Thirty centimeters. I think it's thirty-five to keep these guys. Yep, thirty-five. But he's cool. Another one. times I've never ever caught one. Oh, 
the bait back out. <laughs> bait on my other line but not one bite on that one yet and that's been in the water longer than my other one. Every now and then you get a fish that might bump into the line and get a little twitch going on but then that's about it. Got another little squire. Oh, they're so cute. Bye, Mary. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. We're on again. Another shark. I'm not a fan. Another one of those wobby gong sh sharks, and I'm gonna get wet again. Here we go. Come on, mate. Get my hook out. Very cute fish. I don't like leaving my hooks in them. Sometimes you don't have a choice because you do more damage trying to get them out. They do pull out naturally, which makes me feel a little bit better. Well, bait up and let's go again. It's time for lunch. Don't mind if I do. Get a little bit of a hint of um, filters and squid. That's alright. Flavor. The squid didn't eat much.
fish might have gone off the bite, but I haven't. Just wait. See what happens. I need some more energy. Anybody finds these apricot and strawberry Red Bull, please let me know. They're my favourite and they only make the sugar free ones now and they taste good. raging in as much now so I'm guessing we're on the turn of the tide which will explain why the boat keeps swinging around. So hopefully the fish will start biting as well soon. We hope. We hope. Alrighty. Pitch is back when we find something. Baby squire. They're such a cool fish. They've got cool colours on them. He's so little. He's a baby. Bye buddy. Send your mum and your dad. Oh, he came back to the boat. Bye mate. Still nothing cool happening. But we're just sitting and waiting and chilling. Tide has turned. Boat has fully swung around now. Now we've just got to wait for the fish to come back on this side. Fingers crossed. Another little squire. I am actually jigging using a hand line to try and get bait, but apparently we catch squire instead. I'm not sure about using them for bait. I think they're a cool fish. So, bye mate. Send your mum and your dad. Let's go. That's one mum. Let's go again. We're going to send the cast. No, we're not. It's a freaking hand line, not a cast net. We're going to send, we're going to send hand line out. I don't even have a cast net in my boat. Let's 
see how long until we get a fish. There's some waves coming. I better hold on. My boat's not very big. I don't want to sink. That's a new little species. I'm not sure what that is. No way. That's a baby sweet lip. I think. We'll get this little baby hook out of its face and then we can have a look. Ow, you sharp freaking thing. You made me bleed. Get a little sweet lip. They're so tiny. They got some cool colours on their face. Okay. Bye, mate. Please don't let me catch you. Next time, don't squash. That hurt. Well, I don't think that was a happy moment because it didn't hurt. Where's the big fish? Come on. play my hear fishy song but I, I can't otherwise I get done for copyright on YouTube so I might just pause it here and have a little swear at these fish to tell them to come and take okay. and then when something cool happens we'll come back so this happened Yeah. We had the wheel brace, but it wouldn't go down over the bloody... What a shitty Prado. Well, I've moved fishing spots, but I don't know how I'm going to go here. We're going to give it a try. We're just in a canal of not very many places I can go with a boat on, but we'll see. Well, it is home time now. It is 20 to 6, around about the same time I left home to come fishing this morning, but I am, obviously. Caught a few fish in the boat, caught a Moses perch in the canal, and then I just got snagged. So it's time for me to go home. So thank you everybody for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Tight lines, stay safe.